My name is Mary Ann Bonner and I teach pottery at the Wrights Union Arts and Craft Center. And today I'm going to talk about wedging the clay, which is in preparation for throwing a pot. And then I will demonstrate centering, which is the first step in making a pot on the potter's wheel. Uh, so the first step before you make on a, a pot on the potter's wheel is to prepare the clay, and it's called wedging. And the purpose of wedging is to remove any air bubbles that might be in the clay, and also to make the clay homogenous. Okay, so the first step in making a pot on the potter's wheel is to center the clay. And for centering, you want the wheel going as fast as you can get it to go. And I'm on a kick wheel, so I'm going to kick the wheel. Okay, so I'm going to add water a little on the clay and wet my hands and then the first step is to push the clay with the heels of my hands away and then squeeze around the back with my fingers so the next step once the clay is centered is to make the opening And then uh, the next step is to start to define the inside bottom of the pot. So I'm going to squeeze with my fingers and kind of sweep along the bottom of the pot to define the bottom and thin the bottom. Easing the clay up a little at a time. To shape the pot, once I've made this um, cylinder, I can push out from the inside to change the shape. And then at this stage, it's finished. And when it gets to the stage we call letter hard, then I can turn it upside down and trim the bottom to clean up the bottom a little more and to form a foot on the bottom.